So in the startup world, um, what Science Park structure is we have the different support program for the startup at the very begin at the very beginning. Uh, so if you're doing bootstrapping, uh, we have the ideation program to help you to actually formulate idea, form the team, um, focus on the problem, so, so, uh, problem solution feed and uh, the business plan development. That ideation program, we have 100,000 Hong Kong dollars as a fund to help them, uh, to support them. Right after that, we have the incubation program where it's focusing on the seed stage. Uh, what they do is actually they make the MVP work, portatize it, define their strategy, find the first customers, and prove the go-to-market strategy uh, work. So this incubation program is about three years for non-biotech startup, four years for biotech startup. Uh, they are more on the seed stage. Then we have the, the, we have the acceleration program where it's more on the pre A. Um, it's the stage where they have the first product, they have their first customers. They need to scale fast. So the focus will be in that two years, we push them to expand overseas, to do more business and do fundraising. So all this ideation, incubation and acceleration all together six years is the program support we have. And throughout these six years, uh, if you are any of these programs, uh, we have four services uh, that we focus on to help this app to be successful. Number one, we have the follow service where we'll define the milestone together with the founders in every six months. So we understand what they're doing, what challenges they have, what opportunity they want to, us to help them. So this follow through is something that we have the account managers for every founders. Then we have the upskill services where during the six years, those founders or staff, they have, some of them, they are really successful. They want to do more fundraising. They do want to scale uh, faster. Then we have the upskill team to actually help the founders to improve their pitching skills, fundraising strategy, go to market and team scaling stuff. So this is upskill. Then after upskilling, we want them to actually showcase their achievement to the world. So we bring them to the shows like the MWC, like the CES. We also want to send those founders to a particular countries that they want to expand. Like for example, we send them to the US for six months to focus on their expansion strategy. And finally, we of course, we link all these founders, mentors, alumni together. So these are the four layers of services. Follow, upskill, exposure and linkage. Uh, these are the services we provide to all startups throughout these three programs across six years. First, I start with US. Um, so other than we sending them to CES every year, for example, we send 45, 45 tech companies from Hong Kong to CES. Um, we also have some specialized program um, to help those founders, they really get serious to expand their business in the US. So last year we have an initiative called US Booster, where we send five of the startups, they are on uh, uh, the seed stage to pre-A stage. So the five companies, we achieve over 15 million US dollar contract revenue um, for the five startups. We also have two successful fund raised. Um, for Europe, we start to actually work on something similar. Um, uh, but just as of today, we have been bringing the staff to MWC. We also work with um, Austria. Um, so like Co Austria, we have been sending two winning startups. They will, they will be standing a few months in Austria doing something similar. Uh, we are exploring how we actually work more together with the local stakeholders in Europe and, and to develop something very similar to the US booster going forward.